everybody. So this is the morning of the third day of 2012 and I just couldn't wait to have a video about everything that we got for uh, from Pandora for the holiday season this year or actually last year or both of the year. So I'm really excited to share my Pandora collection with you and to have my first video in 2012. So for today's segment of Ask Natella, I am going to ask all of your questions is what did I buy and what did I get for Christmas and uh, New Year's as well for this year. So the first one I wanted to share with you is the Pandora ornament and the box kind of got damaged. I hope you can see. See like the, uh, the box got damaged a little bit on the side but it's okay. Um, it's just nice to store and I have another video you guys can see that um, the box itself is really nice. So I was kind of upset that it got damaged but the ornaments in transit didn't get ruined at all. So it's just as beautiful as I showed you in the video and now I have one at home. I'm really excited. This one was in the middle of the tree and um, I hope there's going to be more and more Pandora ornaments so the whole tree is going to be a Pandora tree so that's the goal of me and my mom because we love Pandora. So I actually got a few Pandora gifts that you might be familiar with and some that are new. I know that some of you ladies are really smart and you show, uh, shop when there are promotions and I got one of these items and this one is really special for me because my mom used to have a, bo a wine bottle closure a couple of years back that she absolutely loved. She brought it back from Russia and it was broken because it was made out of glass so I think my brother shattered it. But he's a teenager so accidents happen and I was really excited to find this little um, kit from Pandora because she loves it and this is perfect. So it's made out of metal and what I love the most about this item was um, um, is that there is a few uh, crystals on the front and on the back and they're actually sealed so if you're washing it or if this thing falls down and um, you know not really going to break but what the, mo the most important thing about it is that the crystals are not going to fall out and it's always going to stay this beautiful. So I really love this Pandora thing kit I guess and uh, I wanted to give it to her as a present so this one was one of the sentimental moments that we captured this year and it wasn't about the charm but it was something that was replaced this year for her and I was really glad to do that and thanks to Pandora as well. And uh, one more item that I received is this little box and inside there is a really pretty wrapping that they wrapped in the store, thanks Garrett. And um, inside is a really nice um, business card holder. I'm sorry, I'm talking a lot slower today because it's, um, it's about 9 o'clock in the morning. So yeah, <laughs> after New Year's. But um, I put my business cards in here and this is what I love about this item is because a lot of business card holders these days are kind of thin and what I love to do is not only put my business cards in there but also add my credit cards and ID um, on the night out if I don't want to bring the bag or sometimes my bags are kind of bulky I just want to put that in the back pocket of my jeans or in the pocket this is perfect or if I have a small bag and I don't want to bring my huge wallet I just um, put this in here and this is enough to store a few uh, cards, I just have two right now, and then um, just add whatever items you want in here. And that's my new business card as a stylist and a host, I finally got it, so this one is going to be passed out in 2012, and then uh, my new one arrives as well, so this is a perfect item for me to have, um, and my mom got one as well, so this was a two for one deal for us. I love this one and um, the one that I'm going to show you now, I already got a few comments from it, it's the picture frame for Pandora. I know it's not available for everybody, uh, this one actually given to me for the special training that I went to and uh, it's really pretty. It's 5 by 7 and it's in a brush finished and it's going to match perfectly. I gave this one to my mom for this holidays and she loved it because that's where our Christmas uh, picture is gonna go to this year so this one was really really special and yet again we haven't even got to the beads yet I wanted to show it to you closer so it has Pandora on the bottom and uh, the whole thing is just brushed it's just beautiful I love it so now we are
Amazon with Pandora goodies that I wanted to go to the actual jewelry, which, yay, so excited. This year has been truly a Pandora Christmas. So in this lovely box, we have two different bracelets. I got the middle size for the leather bracelet that I did a video before. And you know me, I love Pandora leather bracelets because they're woven and they're not glued on together. And they also have their Pandora signature clasp, which makes it really safe. And that's where the um, special edition or limited edition charms are gonna go on. And I just love to have one on there to separate it from the regular bracelet, just to give it a little extra, I guess, special place. And um, I also got the two-tone bracelet because I told you ladies and gentlemen, I'm going to start the two-tone bracelet in gold and silver and I'm waiting and hoping that maybe one day there's going to be a two-tone bracelet in gold and gold, but white gold and yellow gold and that one is going to be mine for sure. But for now, I'm going to have this one and it's silver all the way around and it has a gold clasp. So I've been wanting this one for a while, so I'm excited to get it. So that's it for the bracelets and let's get on with the charms. Oh my goodness, we did have a lot of charms this year. Between me and my mom, we both have our collection together. So um, we got quite a few of them and uh, some of them we switch. Sometimes I have them, sometimes she has them, but some of them are going to be only for her. Um, like the ones that I personally got her and they will represent me and my brother. These are the new dangly kids. They're so cute. Let me get them a little bit closer so you can see. There you go. I love them. So they're so adorable and the detail on them is really cute. Both of them are smiling so it brought a tear to her eyes and uh, she's going to divide her bracelet into three different sections in the middle. She's going to have herself and then to the uh, left and to the right she's going to have me and my brother. So the first bracelet is finished and I will have a different segment about her bracelet. So uh, she's really excited. This Christmas has been really good about uh, Pandora and filled with Pandora beads, so she's super excited. I got her also the snowflake, she's doing the blue, whoop, where is it, the blue bracelet, and uh, this one has a little blue crystal in the, uh, in the middle and all the way around, and you know I love the beads that are all the way around, because on the bracelet, they're um, kind of rotating, so you can see them, um, you can see the details all the way around when they're on the bracelet, and this one is signifying um, our first Christmas together, my mom immigrated to Canada and I'm in US, so we finally got a chance to kind of get together this year and uh, spend it all together. My brother was here as well, so the whole family was kind of here. And uh, she will all remember, always remember it on her first Pandora bracelet in blue and the snowflake was perfect. She also got a second Murano glass to match her first one in blue and this one is flowers. In Canada, it's uh, always raining or snowing, and um, I just wanted her to have a flower on her bracelet to remind her, you know, of sunny days when it's kind of cold. So I wanted her to have that one to match hers. Um, another one that she got that she was absolutely crazy about is the little strawberry. I live in California, so the strawberry is perfect. I hope you guys can see the detail on it. There you go. It's super cute, and the funny thing is that this one was probably one of the most inexpensive charms that I got her this holiday season, and it brought her to tears because she wanted it so badly, and we didn't have it in the store, so I had to wait for like three or two days before I was leaving for the holidays, and we got it. I was so excited to have it, and this one was the last addition to her collection this year and brought her to tears as well, so I guess it was a win-win situation. Um, the one that I loved the most was the bag. This purse is so cute. It's in two-tone. It has a bow in four, so, solid 14 karat gold on the front and uh, it's just like a really cute detailed bag. So this one is going to go on the two-tone bracelet in 2012. So that one was awesome. And to continue the two-tone collection, I got my mom a whoop. <laughs> I love you bead that has 14 karat solid gold on 
one of the silver sides and then it has let's go the other way it has I love you all the way around I love this bead for a reason obviously the sentimental reason of me loving her but also it's really shiny and it adds a lot of shine to your bracelet so either you love yourself your significant other got it for you your kids um, your friends, uh, whoever got this, or get this for you, you have to have this bead on your bracelet because I just think that it's an incredible bead, it's shiny, and it's going to make your bracelet so much brighter with just this one little bead. And the other one that I got for her, and this one is going to represent her on the um, side that she's going to use to represent her and it's queen bee of course because she is the queen of our beehive right now and uh, it's just so cute the detail on it is also really adorable and it has a two-tone it's a two-tone bead but it has a um, gold crown if you can see but the funny thing about this bead is it is smiling I don't know if you can see it very well wait I'm gonna learn how to do this I think you can see there that it's smiling it is so adorable I love it so this is one of my favorites as well just for the last sake it's just so cute and it's so her um, and one of the last ones that I will show you from the two-tone bracelet that is coming up and it's going to be done in 2012 is I got one clip and another one is coming just exactly the same one I love this one for the same feel of um, the Murano glass that I got and this one is really shiny just like the I love you one so it's gonna go really well with the bracelet and also has um, a flower in there and the flower is really solid so I love it I think it's uh, retail for about $80 or something like that but the flower is really large and it's on front side and on the back side as well so I thought it was a great deal for this bead shiny with a lot of gold I like it it gets my pick so I picked that one as well and um, of course no bracelet should go without a safety chain this one is a two-tone and um, from what I hear it's a retired one at this moment and uh, so they're in the stores while supplies, la supplies last but I got it when I didn't even know that it was um, gonna be taken off the market so I just got it because it was my favorite one um, one because it's two tone second because it has hearts I know Pandora is known for their hearts so I'll get everything that has a heart on because I think it's just um, it's a nice bead and uh, it's safe because I want my bracelet to be safe this one is pretty cool and I have a lot of beads they're expensive and I don't want to lose any of them so a safety chain is a must so now I'm going to finish with all of my three most special beads and I have another segment on them because you guys asked me to, uh, about just them specifically but I wanted to quickly mention them because we got them for Christmas as well. So one is the Black Friday charm and it's the Black Midnight Heart charm for 2011 limited edition. Some of you ladies already seen this and it has three different uh, enamels, uh, enamel heart in there in black and one that has 2011 in there in solid 14 karat gold and it's great. I absolutely love it. It's super special and it has 2011 which signifies our holiday season all together this year. Another one that I got that my brother got was um, the Canadian bead that was actually really special as well because it was it is a limited edition bead for Vancouver Olympic Games that were in Canada and since half of my family is Canadians uh, this bead is going to be perfect and also it's not available anywhere else but in Canada so I was really glad that I got this for Christmas and I was not expecting it at all so this is super duper special to me and it's in white enamel and it has kind of like a snowflake effect all the way around two Canadian maple leaves on the front in kind of reddish orange to uh, go along with the colors of Canada and it's really beautiful in silver oh I love this bead this is just ultimate favorite and last but not least and actually my favorite bead because I snatched it from Toronto store and I didn't even know that they had this bead so I got there paid a little bit extra money and uh, got this this one is retired right now and it's called the promise bead and you can see it's still in the Pandora box because I don't want to take it out it's going with me to Canada uh, to um, Los Angeles in a few days back home 
So this one is in black and white. It has stones all the way around, so you can see it on the bracelet. And um, I love this one because it comes in two different colors, and I've seen the purple one a few times, but because I wanted to do the black and white bracelet, this one is going to be perfect, and I was so excited to get it because this one was just... Um, something that I didn't even expect to see it in the Toronto store and I just stopped by and said hello to them there and just wanted to see what they have and they had something 